Hello, everyone. I'm Zhao Chua. Today, let's draw a kangaroo. Kangaroos have many species, such as the red kangaroo in front of me, the wallaby, and some others. When drawing the kangaroo, we can draw it sitting as this model shows, which could present many features of it. Such as its legs. This posture could show its entire legs, including the position of the joints, and how the proportion of each bone looks like, and its tail could play a role as a stool. In addition, when sitting, the kangaroo's head would raise up, which shows the real length of its neck. When drawing the kangaroo, we must pay attention to some key points. One is that the face of kangaroos looks like that of a rat, but with a relatively square head. It has two big ears, which look a bit like those of rabbits. Its forelimbs are very short and with long clawed hands. Its entire back arches up in a prominent curve. Its hind limbs are very long. Its two feet, especially the part between its heel and its toes, which is called metatarsus bone, is very long. After we knowing all the points, we can start to draw the kangaroo. Let's make the composition first. The top of its head is about here. Compared with its body, its head is very small. We need to determine the general shape of its head first. This is about the length of its neck. Here are its arms. We put the upper arms here followed by its forearms. Its hands are like this. Next, let's draw the shape of its back. When the red kangaroo stands, it uses its tail to support its weight, therefore, its back bends. We need to draw its tail backward and end it here. It has thick and strong thighs and long shanks. Its ankles, like human heels, touch the ground. When it rests, they touch the ground, but when it jumps, they move down. After we determine general shapes, let's draw the details of each part. First, let's draw its head. Its head generally looks like a mixture of the rabbit's and the rat's heads. The red kangaroo has a square nose and a very small mouth. Its nasal tip is a wide black triangle. Let's draw its big eyes here. Now let's draw its square face. One of its distinctive features is its two big diamond shaped ears. After drawing its head, let's draw its neck and chest downward. Followed by its upper arms and forearms. Next, let's draw its hand which looks like that of the rabbit. Then let's draw the other hand.
After that, let's draw the curve on its back. Make this line coherent. Its shoulders slightly protrude like this. Then let's draw its thick and strong thigh, below which we can draw some fur. The red kangaroo has thick fur. Now let's draw its shank. At the root of its shank, we can draw thick muscles. Let's draw the end very thin and the part touching the ground thinner. Let's draw its strong ankle. Its sole touches the ground when it rests. We can draw nails at the end of its toes. Then let's draw its abdomen and the other leg. Here, we can draw some shadows. Next, let's draw its strong tail, which looks like a stool on the ground. Then let's draw some fur on its tail. Lastly, in the shadows, let's draw some fur with such small strokes. Following the direction of its body to show the sense of volume as well as the texture of its fur. Good, like this, we've finished drawing the red kangaroo.